let's talk about the Outlook integration uh, and Lightning Sync. You go to Setup and then you can type here Light Outlook integration and Lightning Sync in Quick Find box. You end up here. So you, um, if you want to turn it on, you have to turn it on here. You you toggle the switch here. Get data from reps, Microsoft email, contact, and events into Salesforce. Reps can view and search relevant Salesforce records from the Outlook inboxes and relate important email Salesforce record using the Outlook integration. Reps contact and events sync between the Microsoft Exchange and Salesforce using Lightning Sync. So if you go down, give users integration Outlook. Uh, you had when you click here, you can download to use integration each Outlook. Users need to Salesforce add in for Outlook. We recommend that users use add in from Microsoft App Store or the Exchange admins. Get the add in to distribute using Microsoft Centralized Deployment. Using this method, ensure the users always have the access to the latest features in each release without having a reinstalled add on. So um here you get the manifest file if the company security policy don't allow access to microsoft apple app source download the manifest file and distribute it to your outlook users log email message to salesforce while composing is the next item it's already use enhanced email with outlook is enabled here this is about email to salesforce are you already activated it? Inbox in the Outlook integration. Uh, you can edit the settings. Select who can use Inbox, who can't use, assign, you have to assign permission sets. Here you add new email panes. Here email application pen assignment by profile. You can assign by profile the pa the pen access. This is the email application publisher layout. You can get a new and you can assign the publisher layout assignment. This is the mapping users who have linked to Salesforce some Outlook. Microsoft Outlook web app domains. Outlook.com, Office365.com. These are the uh, domains. You, it is enabled. You have to enable. You have to check it. The checkbox allow access from any domain in the Salesforce Manage list. You can click New uh, to add a new domain. This about Lightning Sync here. 